Hey, what's up guys? So today's video, I'm upstate New York right now in the Hudson Valley and um, I'm gonna be fishing this lightly pressured pond up here. That's why I chose this lake because you barely get any people fishing in it. It's completely the opposite of what I fish, you know, back home on Long Island. If you're new to my channel, I fish, um, you know, mainly on Long Island, New York. That's where I'm from. But today we're upstate New York in like Catskill Hudson area. I got this this nice little pond here. It's very lightly pressured. It's a uh, it's gonna be awesome fishing, I think. But I'm gonna start out throwing a Senko on a weedless Senko because there it looks like there's a little bit of weeds here. It's still been pretty warm upstate here, and the weeds haven't really died off yet. We got like a bunch of seaweed, well not seaweed, but just regular weeds right here in front of me fun part is when you catch the fish you gotta get them over that maybe I'll try a different spot first real quick so I'm gonna throw some Senkos out there got these yum Senkos this is a smoke pearl colored Senko nice nice and brand new I like going with this color because it kind of looks like a shad. It's got that gray color on top with the white bottom. And it definitely makes the bass, you know, attracted to this. They like that. So I'm just using a, um, a 3 aught you know, worm hook. And I'm putting it on Texas rigged. Definitely want to go weedless here. Even though the water looks fine out there, there is a nice, uh, nice layer of weeds, you know, just below. All right, so we're good to go. It's a relatively small pond. It's not too big, but this pond's loaded with bass, crappie. Maybe even some carp in here. So I'm just working the sinkle really slow, letting it um, sink down into the weeds. And then I'll just give, you know, a couple jerks and a slight retrieve and just let it, you know, sink down slowly. That's when the bass usually come up and just swoop up and grab it. There we go, fish on. Ooh, he feels nice. Yeah. I gotta tighten my drag a little. We gotta get him over these weeds. Come on. Oh yeah, this was a nice lunker. Holy first bass huge wow woohoo look at that guy woohoo that, that's what fishing a lightly pressured pond is all about crush that Senko
There we go. Whew, look at this girl. First bass today. At least a three pounder. Easily. I would weigh him, but I just want to keep fishing after this one. Now, I got so many weeds here in front of me, so I kind of got to throw them past that. I don't want to release them right in this stuff. <laughs> yeah, he's good. I know that ain't the best release, but it's better for the fish. If I just drop him right here in front of me, he might get stuck in it. I don't have waders on, so I wouldn't be able to go out there and get him. Man, that's a great way to start this uh, fishing out and hit that shad-colored Senko. There we go, fish on. He hit that on the retrieve. Ooh. Not as big as that first one. Definitely a nice bass though. I got some nice sized ones in this pond. Yeah, he ain't, he ain't no three, four pounder like that first one, but awesome fish. Man, this is a ton of fun catching these bass like this. I forgot how, how much fun freshwater fishing is. I've been doing so much salt water lately. Feels good to get out again and do some fresh water. So the gear I'm using today is a 7 foot rod, it's a medium strength, fast action, and I'm just using um, 10 pound braid on with a uh, 10 pound uh, floral leader. See if maybe I could find an opening down on this side more of the pond. I keep hearing some splashes over there, so um, yeah, let's go try to move around see if we could get over there. All right, I see a good spot. Nice opening over here. That's the only thing when you're fishing a lightly pressured lake, there's not really a lot of openings. Kind of got to make your own spots. All right, this will work perfect. We're in the shade over here too, so that's good. I feel like the bass are gonna be over here. They wanna get out of that sun. Man, I hear something in the woods over there. I guess it's turkey, because it sounds exactly like those turkey calls. This is so cool fishing upstate, man. We don't get any of this on the island. Oh, there we go. Nice. Jumping out. Oh no, he's heading for the grass. Woo! Wild bass. They are full of energy here. Nice one. All quality size, size bass in this pond. All right, we got another bass. It's probably about a pound and a half, almost two pounder. Nice bass, a little dirty. Look at that, he destroyed my Senko. I gotta put another one on. Fish on. And these upstate bass are so aggressive. He 
He's another nice sized one. All quality fish in this pond, man. This is awesome. Another nice bass. Still haven't got any of the size of the, my uh, first one, but we're getting some nice quality fish in here. Uh, I need the pliers. He kind of choked this. See, he choked it a little bit. All right, let's get him back in. He got a little bloody because he choked it. But he should be fine. Yeah, he swam off. So I think I'm going to do maybe a few more casts over here. See if I can get at least a couple more, maybe one more over here. And then um, I'm going to work my way back to where I first started. Try to like head back towards the car. It is getting kind of late. And I still got to meet back up with my family and eat some dinner. Oh, there we go. Fish on. Ooh, he's running. Oh, it came off. Darn it. He felt good. There we go. Fish on. <laughs> uh, he's a smaller one. Aggressive little guy. Nice, healthy little bass. <laughs> yeah, he was jumping when I threw him back. I think I'm going to make my way back to where I first started. Try a few more casts there, then I think it's going to be time to call it. So let's make our way back over there. The fun part is we got to do some rock climbing now. Woohoo, muddy. All right, we just got over here where I first started. Gonna try just a couple casts, see if anything bites, and then that's it for me. All right, that's it for me. It's getting too late, I gotta get going. Man, what an awesome outing it was today here at this lake. Caught that monster three, four pounder right, right away on my first fish. And then after that, we got a ton of other fish. Nice, aggressive, uh, decent sized ones too. Man, you gotta love fishing upstate. It's so much better than the island. It's all about that lightly pressured, you know, ponds and lakes. But um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely give me a thumbs up if you like what you saw. And uh, definitely subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned for the next one. Thanks for watching.